Here's what you need to know before you go. I'm Mary Calvi. And I'm Natalie Dutteridge. Police are trying to find the suspect who stabbed an 18 year old on a subway train. This happened last night on a D train as it was pulling into the 4th Avenue and Pacific Street station in Brooklyn. Police say two men got into a fight. The victim did not survive and the suspect took off. A person of interest is now in custody in the shooting of a rookie NYPD officer in Jamaica, Queens. Officer Brett Bowler is expected to make a full recovery after being shot in the hip Wednesday. The NYPD PD says it will hold a news conference about the shooting later this morning. And a live look at City Field, where the New York Mets play their home opener today. They will face off against the Miami Marlins at 1 this afternoon. The game was supposed to take place Thursday, but it was postponed due to weather. Let's get your final check of your first alert forecast. Here's John. Going today, jacket. Probably not a bad idea. You'll be in the upper 50s for the first pitch and upper 50s for your high today. It's breezy, though. Gusty winds at times. We're seeing little shower activity just south and west of the city. But drier wind will take over, so it's cool and dry. 39 tonight in the city. Look at this. We're going to see readings in the 20s in parts of the Hudson Valley, so make sure that you're ready for that. Very chilly tonight into your Saturday morning, and then we see some nicer conditions for the remainder of the holiday weekend, so the real cool pocket will be tonight into the first part of the weekend, and then if next week is your week off, boy, that's a home run. We're going to see numbers above normal and in a big way could see some thermometers hit 80 by Thursday of next week. Have a great and blessed Good Friday and the remainder of the weekend as well. Back to you guys.